My name is Kwasha and today I'm going to be showing you a demonstration of carbon distribution to this. Carbon is an in important indicator of soil health because it is used by the microorganisms in order to mineralize and make nitrogen available. Um, these samples that you see here in front of you have been taken at um, four different depths, 15 centimeters, 30 centimeters, 45 centimeters, and 60 centimeters. In this experiment, I'm going to be using hydrogen peroxide to find out how much carbon there is in each sample. I will be pouring 100 ml of hydrogen peroxide on each sample of soil. The 15 cm soil sample has got more bubbles that have formed, which is expected because that sample was taken at a higher depth, which is filled with more organic matter. The depths that follow, which are the 30 cm, 45 cm, and 60 cm depth, do not have as much bubbles that have formed compared to the 15 cm. This tells us that, that those samples have got lesser carbon than the 15 cm. were taken on a soil that has been planted with permanent pastures. The challenge for farmers is to build this carbon through depths, which is actually necessary for your microorganisms to be able to perform processes linked to mineralization. More carbon in your soil means that there will be more microorganisms, microorganisms that facilitate the process of nitrogen mineralization. It also means that you have more water to store in your soil as well as better structure, which are all important for better pasture productivity. <music>